hello student again in this video i am going to show you an exercise of ms excel okay so and from my screen you can see there have a exercise which name is exercise 2 okay you can see the objectives of this exercise is working with the if statement okay first of all i am going to implement this table okay so i am going to open a ms excel file then i will implement this table okay so for open a ms excel file just right click from your mouse go to new option and click here this is microsoft excel worksheet okay just open it So this is my blank Microsoft Excel worksheet, okay? And this is my assignment, okay? Okay, so now you can see this is my assignment, okay? And this is the thing which I have to implement in Excel. Now I am typing here item number. Okay. Next number of items. Number of items. Okay. Now this text overlapping from this cell just click here and then click on wrap text option okay this is wrap text option okay click here okay for this one also okay okay next is item price item price next is tax next total price before tax next total price after Tax. Next rate. Okay. Now, now do one thing. Select A one or B one, and click on this format painter, and paste the format for the rest. Okay. Okay. Now you can see the background color of this row is i think this one okay okay now do one thing first of all look at this table there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 column and 14 row. Just select from here 7 column and 14 row. Okay. And insert here cell style. Okay. So choose this one. Okay. Okay. Now the background color is this one. Okay. Now type A two. Okay. 
that is 100 next 101 okay next number of item 115 next 256 next 49 next 23 next 840 next 200 next 294 next 4 okay now type item price this is 30 next 12 next 56 next 150 next 5 next 56 next 300 next 90 okay then this thing i will find out okay now next you can see this text okay count of items average of tax mean mean item price max item price okay for typing this text i have to merge these two cell okay so for count of item just merge these two cell okay okay select the cell and choosing this merge option okay and copy the cell format for the rest rows okay now type here count of items okay count count of items next average of tax next <coughs> mean item price next max item price okay now you have to find out this thing also okay now i'm showing you the question but okay so first question is now question number one is tax if item price is less than 100 then tax is 50 otherwise tax should be 100 okay so it is very simple for find out it here i am using if function okay so just type if now click here logical test what is the logical test logical text is this thing that is if the item price is less than 100 then tax will be 50 otherwise 100 okay item price item price is there okay this one is item price item price is less than 100 if item price is less than 100 then this tax will be 50 and otherwise 100 okay now close the bracket and press enter from your keyboard okay so this item price is only 30 that's why this tax is 50 okay and paste the formula for the rest you can see 150 and 300 is more than from 100 that's why the tax is 100 okay now i will find out total price before tax and it will be number of item into item price so it will be is equal to number of item multiply item price item price is 30 okay now press enter now 
copy the formula and paste it for the rest rows okay next total price after tax now the total price after tax will be total price before tax plus tax so it will be is equal to total price before tax plus tax okay this thing total price before tax plus tax okay now press enter now copy the formula for the rest row okay next is rate it will be rate okay it will be rate okay there are some typing mistake okay next is rate okay what is the rate rate if the total price after tax is more than 3500 then rate is high okay otherwise it will be reasonable okay so for find out this thing again i will use if function okay so student please remember one thing okay if you type any text like high or reasonable okay then you have to write it inside these two colon okay and if you typing any number inside the if function okay then you don't need to type this clone okay okay the formula will be is equal to if then this thing this is total price after tax now type here this is total price after tax click here get at then how much 3500 okay next type here high otherwise reasonable okay now close the bracket so here i not using this double clone okay now if you type enter from your keyboard okay so it is showing some error okay now now again click here and put the double clone now press shift key from your keyboard with the double clone sign key again repeat it again repeat it again repeat it okay now type enter from your keyboard okay now you can see the total price after tax is 3500 it is not more than 3500 okay that's why the answer is reasonable okay now copy the formula and paste it for the remaining rows okay now you can see where this number is more than 3500 it is high okay and for the rest it is reasonable okay it is not too much tough okay now count the total item okay so student here i am going to count the total item okay for this i will use here the sum function okay just type is equal to sign from your keyboard now type sum from your keyboard now select this range okay close the bracket and type enter from the keyboard this is 1781 this is the total items okay now average of tax tax is here okay now type is equal to average now select this range close the bracket and type enter from your keyboard 
एवरेज ऑफ टैक्स इज सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फाइव ना मिनिमम आइटम प्राइस और फाइंड आउट मिनिमम आइटम प्राइस टाइप इज इक्वल टू देन टाइप मीन देन सिलेक्ट दिस रेंज नाउ टाइप एंटर फ्रॉम योर कीबोर्ड सो यू कैन से मिनिमम आइटम प्राइस इज फाइव नेक्स्ट मैक्सिमम टाइप इज इक्वल टू साइन फ्रॉम योर कीबोर्ड देन टाइप मैक्स मैक्स फॉर मैक्सिमम नाउ सिलेक्ट द रेंज ओके नाउ प्रेस एंटर नाउ यू कैन सी द आंसर इज थ्री हंड्रेड ओके इफ यू लुक एट हेयर यू कैन सी द मैक्सिमम आइटम प्राइस इज थ्री हंड्रेड ओके एंड मिनिमम इज फाइव ओके सो दिस इज द असाइनमेंट थ्री ओके नाउ प्लीज चेक द क्वेश्चन ओके दिस वन डन दिस वन डन दिस वन डन दिस वन आल्सो डन फाइंड काउंट ऑफ आइटम्स एवरेज ऑफ टैक्स मेन आइटम प्राइस मैक्स आइटम प्राइस इट इज ऑलरेडी डन नेक्स्ट इज नेक्स्ट इज सेव फाइल एज एक्सरसाइज फोर नाउ डू वन थिंग click on this file option next click on this save option okay now type here exercise 4 okay exercise 4 then click on this save option okay now it is done okay so student if any of you have any doubt or any question please type your question in the comment section okay so thank you thanks for watching